आर यू टायर्ड ऑफ पेइंग हेफ्टी सब्सक्रिप्शन फीस एवरी मंथ just to upscale your images are you afraid to take the plunge to buy a pricey software that you might need to upgrade in next two or three years does this sound like a sales pitch to you well it certainly isn't today i'm going to explain to you about a software that is absolutely free and that is as good as if not better than industry leaders like topaz gigapixel and adobe lightroom also with the access to a large library of different open source models It is very easy to fine tune and find the perfect model for a particular image. Well to install the software let's first head into the GitHub library. The link is in the description. Here as you can see there are several different models of the software. You should go to the latest available model. It takes you to the download page. Here you can select the download file according to your operating system. As I have Windows I am going with Windows version. As you can see the downloads has started. As you can see the software has already been downloaded. Let's just install it. And before we can get started we need to download few more things let's go to here to the download icon click on it here you can see there are three things that needs to be downloaded to get this working pytorch ncnn onnx you just have to click on them to get them downloaded the pytorch is going to take some time as you can see it's 2 gb in size Now as you can see the required packages are downloaded nice and clean let's close this first to get started you need some models chainer is just the framework the models do the actual works now just let you get some beautiful models here i have attached the link to the model database there are lots and lots of models for you to choose from you can choose any of that download that and use them as i already have a few models downloaded i'll just skip this step now let's go to image load image put it in here this is where you will add your images now you need to bring your model in you can search here with writing model under pytorch load model just bring it in here what we are going to do we are going to upscale the image right let's search for upscale here in under pytorch again upscale image okay once we have upscaled our images we need to save them in a directory to use them right now go for save image here it is first let's bring in your image left click here uh, let's select this one you have already seen this one in my tutorial about five ai image upscalers let's open it the image is imported now let's go to import our model left click here this is my collection of models right now i am going to select 4x ultra sharp this is my favorite model at present now let's drag the image node to upscale image similarly with model let's drag it here in the model tab and then let's bring the output to save image here here you have to put an image name for that uh, right now i am just writing out you also have to specify a directory where you want your images to be exported let's select folder now let's play the sequence as you can see it's completed let's go to the folder here is the output image if you just go to the properties you can see the image has been upscaled to 4096 by 4096 now just upscaling one image at once is not going to do it for you right you need to upscale a batch of images a lot of images all together at once well depending on how well your pc can perform obviously now let's see how we can upscale batch images at once in chainer now search for image file iterator just bring it in here you can see there is already one load image option this one loads multiple images all at once and just like before load model upscale image save image you need to bring in two more dishes to the plate first search for math and next is text append why are these important well you will learn in a minute we choose our model here instead of selecting a specific image we select a specific folder let's select folder and it is gonna import all the images in that folder in just like before we connect the dots image to image model to model and upscale image to save image we select a directory to export the images in the image name chainer again image extension we'll select jpg quality 100 now let's hit play okay it's completed now let's get back to the folder and see how it turned out see just one image why did it turn out this way now let's go back to the chainer app and find out it was given only one output name for the images and as it had only one output name it could not 
create more than one images with the same name therefore all the images created replaced each other and ended in one final image now how to correct that let's go here overall index bring it to math as you can see it just changed the number here from 0 to 7 the math operation i have put here is addition it would add one to every next image let's add one let's bring the result to text a for the text b let's just write chain r again and then now the output text would go to here to the image name now let's get back to the folder again shall we here are the images they are all upscaled right now now this image properties details here 4k by 4k 96 dpi if you want something like 300 or 600 you can just go to a software and change it there are lots of free softwares out there let me know in the comments which model you are using and if out of those models i like anyone myself i'll try to make a tutorial on that or a review of that model